yeah, check this thing out. It's a bottle rocket car and it's about to take off and go flying. Let's get this ready. In three, two, one. Drop the Mentos and go! Whoa! Oh yeah! Whoa! Whoa! What are you guys doing? Oh, my car, my car! There it goes! So today's challenge will be the world's fastest bottle rocket car will win the next gold treasure. All you have to do is build the fastest concoction you think you can have. You start on this line, you pull the Mentos down, the Mentos goes in, and then your car goes woo! Super, super fast, and it has to get all the way to the finish line. And the first car that crosses the finish line is the winner. Today's competitors will be Steven, me, and John. Let's see who will win. Let's go build our bottle rockets and let's see who will win the golden treasure. All right, you guys, let's start building. Everyone grab your one liter of soda. Here, John. Thank I'll you. Take mine. And we have our own little cars with the wheels that will go zooming across the driveway. But that's not all. We have all these school supplies. We have colored paper, folders, stickers, these pom-pom things, glitter, slime, and all this wonderful stuff. And we have to figure out how to make our car the fastest with this supplies. Well, that's easy. I can start building mine first. I know okay. exactly what I need. I'm gonna take my car base just like this to get the car to finish across the line faster. It's all about adding more weight so it has more momentum once it catches up to speed. So not only am I going to have the soda on the back like this, but I'm going to add more weight, starting with some Play-Doh. Uh, Steven, your rocket's on backwards. Is it backwards? You have to go this way. That. Yeah. Now strap it on. Okay, strapping it on, securing it in place, and let's get this thing going. Now we're gonna take the Play-Doh just like this, and then you just wanna create an aerodynamic little section here to add weight onto the car. Ooh. Just like this, a little heavier weight there, and there we go. A little heavier weight right here, just like that. Boom. Kinda looks like a dinosaur. Kinda looks like a dinosaur, but it's aerodynamic fins for the wind to go across like this, and then extra weight to hold this car down onto the ground, so it's got a lot of momentum once it gets up to speed. Move aside, Steven. I think I have an even better idea. Let me sit down in the creation station. All right, so for my bottle rocket car, I'm going to use these pom-pom things. And I'm going to put one on each side so it bounces out and it'll go in a straight line and not turn off the course. So let's get the tape, let's strap these on, and I'm about to win this race. My car, I'm gonna take some notebook paper, super colorful notebook paper, and rip it out just like that and use some scissors cut a couple different flame shapes to tape onto the back to improve aerodynamics. And then we'll grab some tape and tape these on. Here's three green ones and I need three orange ones. All right, now that my rocket looks fast, I need to make it fast. And to do that, I'm gonna use some wonder sand and then put it around the top to make it really heavy. All right? Uh-oh. This might not work. It's just yeah, I fall you apart. put sand on your bottle. <laughs> oh no. All right, I'm gonna use Play-Doh instead because I think that's gonna work better. All right, there we go. Put that down, mold it into as big a shape as possible, and then put it all right about there, I think. All right, and then to make sure it doesn't flip over, I'm also gonna put some on the bottom so I can lower the center of gravity. Oh, like a Tesla. Ooh. Yeah, they've got the batteries on the bottom. Same thing. Ooh, guys, we should say what model car we have. Looks like John's is the Tesla, and I think mine might be like a Ferrari, which be fast. Steven, what is yours? Mine is its own brand called the Share brand. This is the Share brand? Yeah. Looks kind of more like a G-Wagon or a Hummer. Yeah, I think the Share brand needs to work on this design a little bit. <laughs> That's gonna be the one that wins. Or maybe it's the punch buggy, because it's pink. All right, there we go. I think that'll stay. All right, and then these are note flags. I think I'm gonna put them on the back, so that way it looks extra fast. And then a green one on this side, right there. What looks do you like, think? Actually, this kind of looks like a fish because the two eyes and the fish tails down there. Ooh. Yeah, it looks like a backward swimming fish. Sweet, it looks like all our cars are made. Let's go take them to the test track and see who will win the challenge. Alrighty, we're back at the starting line and it's going to be Steven versus John and whoever wins this round will verse me and be the ultimate winner. So, John and Steven, line up your cars. Just like that. I'm gonna go just like this. Okay. And 
then what do we do? We just unscrew this top and screw this on. So you're starting at this starting line, the white, and you have to make it all the way down there to the orange finish line, the fastest. Okay, you ready, John? All right, let's unscrew So this take off. off your tops. Here we go, get ready. Whoa, a lot of bubbling. Top off. Top off. On. Put your Mentos on, hopefully. The red notch is pushed in. Okay. Okay, Mentos are right. twisted on. Now what? So I'll count you guys down, and once I say go, you'll pull the little red tab out, your Mentos will drop, and then the soda starts blasting like crazy. Okay, you ready, John? I'm ready. Okay, I'm gonna stand back, because it's about to get crazy. Steven versus John, comment down below who you think is gonna win. Ready. Okay, count us down, Grace. Okay, in three, Two, one, drop. Go, go, go. Woo! 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 Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I didn't go so fast. That was perfect. John, what happened to yours? It went right off the side. Oh, it totally tipped over. It's, Car crash. Oh, the Tesla battery messed him up. Oh, no. Mine was perfect. I only got a little bit of soda on me, and mine took off. Went down a pretty straight line and like crashed all the way over there. That's oh, it flipped about. over. That wow. It's called Play Doh Mod. I love that. <laughs> well, Steven, you clearly won that round, yeah. which means you get to go to the next round and verse me. But sorry, John, you're out. Your car took a tumble. All right, well, Grace, you get ready. I'm gonna go refill and uh, get ready to verse me. I'm gonna win again. I know how to do this. It's all about the Play-Doh, oh yeah. Alrighty, go get your car. I'll meet you at the starting line. Next round will be me versus Steven. I got my little Mentos power thing all set and ready. Let's line up. Let's put our cars in place. Okay, I'm gonna do lane one this time. Okay, I'll be lane two. Put it, make sure I'm going straight ahead. Share us, oh. comment down below who you think is gonna win. Hashtag Steven. Or hashtag Grace, let's see. I hope I win. Let's tip our cars up. Carefully untwist it. Whoa. Make sure it doesn't spill out. Okay? Right. Put the cap aside. Put your Mentos Power Rocket on. Okay. Twist it. Alrighty, I'm ready for the drop test. I am ready. Three, two, one, go! Come on, come on, come on. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Mine barely made it to the finish line, but it made it. Mine was so close. It got yeah, right here, yeah, and then it swerved yeah. off course. No. Mine was faster at the beginning, though. That's what I'm talking about. It's all about that Play-Doh mod. You know what? There is no competition right now, Cher. So far, I have two points. No one else has even come close <laughs> to beating me. So you know what I'm thinking? All three of us go again at the same time, and whoever wins this final round is the ultimate winner, gets the gold bar, and calls it the next winning prize. Ooh, okay, John, we gotta win this time. Let's get our bottle rockets ready. Let's get to the starting line. Get ready for the final round. It's going to be Steven versus me versus John. Three cars at once. Things are going to get wild. I'm ready to drop in and go. I'm the ultimate challenge winner, so let's do this. Alrighty, Steven's in lane one. I'm in lane two. And John's in lane three. All right. Who's going to get the gold bar? Let's find out. Are we ready? Yeah. Tip yeah. your cars up. Cars up. Untwist your cap. Make sure it doesn't spill out. Okay. And then put your Mentos rocket on top. Twist it on just like that. And then. I'm locked. I'm loaded. Okay. I'm locked. I'm loaded. I'm ready to go. Everyone ready? ready for the drop test? Okay. Okay. Let's do this. Here we go. In three, three two, one, one go. go. There we go, there we go. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Oh, oh. I think mine beat yours. Wait a second. I don't think it went off. Mine definitely went across the finish line. I think mine went across too. I think John's fell you. off. No, I think John's fell I'm, off. I'm certain that mine passed yours. Oh. It didn't fall off the side. Well, guys, that was a really close tie. Yeah. Let's replay that and see who really wins and will win the golden treasure. <laughs> Alrighty, shares. The results are in. And check it out. You can see proof right here. John's soda string went right here and then fell off just before the finish line. 
but Steven almost fell off, but didn't and crossed the finish line. So Steven, you are the lucky winner. The ultimate Very winner lucky. here, Shares. Like I said, if you comment hashtag Steven, you are awesome. Oh yeah, I'm gonna be looking through those comments. Whoever commented my name, I'm gonna be giving you a like, nice little heart in the comments. Well Steven, you won this challenge, but there's more challenges to come. So Shares, comment down below any great ideas of challenges you wanna see us do next. And until then, Shares, you know what to do. Stay, Stay awesome, awesome and, and share, share the love. love. Peace, woo!